So we really believe it's important that these trial results are now available in the peer-reviewed literature. Uh, this was a study, a phase one, two study of multi-stem for the treatment of acute respiratory distress syndrome. The study was conducted before uh, the recent emergence of the COVID-19 uh, worldwide pandemic. Uh, this trial really confirmed the safety of adult stem cell therapy for the treatment uh, of this acute critical illness, uh, ARDS. These are patients who have severe hypoxemic respiratory failure, uh, are on ventilators in the ICU, and frequently have uh, comorbid organ failure syndromes, including even hemodynamic instability. So it's certainly not trivial uh, to have a trial result that confirms the safety of IV infusion of cells into these patients. Um, the results that we saw were consistent uh, with safety uh, of this treatment procedure, uh, and the cells were well tolerated uh, throughout the course of the ICU stay. Uh, and we actually followed patients for a full year uh, after their treatment course uh, to assess both safety, but then also we looked at efficacy outcomes. So how did the patients fare in terms of getting off of the ventilator, potentially discharged from the ICU, impacts on mortality? And I think quite importantly, we followed patients for the full year and assessed uh, impacts on quality of life uh, among survivors uh, of this uh, really pretty devastating illness. Um, there's often a, a very prolonged period of recovery for patients that do survive uh, and a high mortality uh, among all patients. And although the trial was not powered for statistical significance in evaluation of these efficacy endpoints, we did see some encouraging signs that support further development uh, of this uh, treatment uh, in this indication. So we did see lower mortality among those who received multi-stem therapy uh, compared to those who received placebo. Uh, we did see shorter mean and median times uh, to ventilator liberation in those treated with multi-stem compared with placebo. And importantly, uh, throughout the course of the year, uh, we saw comparable or actually improved uh, quality of life outcomes among survivors that were treated with multi-stem in comparison to those that survived following treatment with placebo. Um, so I think all in all, this trial uh, was enthusiastically received uh, by the clinical investigators who participated and others familiar with the field uh, and really spurred our efforts to further develop this therapy uh, for acute respiratory distress syndrome. And now, of course, in the context of the COVID-19 pandemic, to move forward with a, uh, a well-powered uh, randomized placebo-controlled trial of multi-step for the treatment of both COVID and non-COVID uh, infection-induced uh, ARDS. I want to honestly thank uh, the investigators who participated as well as the entire research teams uh, at the study sites we worked with throughout the UK and US. Uh, and I think most importantly, I want to thank uh, the participants themselves, uh, the patients uh, and their families on their behalf uh, who volunteered to participate uh, in a study of this novel treatment uh, modality for acute respiratory distress syndrome.